Welcome to the John and Heidi Show podcast. John and Heidi. Here's John and Heidi. Today is a special day, Heidi. Do you know what today is? What is today, John? I thought you'd never ask, Heidi. It's the whole weekend here, so let's do it all. I'm sorry, it's the weekend, so let's do the whole thing. That makes more sense. <laughs> Saturday, April 1st, of course, April Fool's Day. It's also National Play Outside Day, National Handmade Day, National Sourdough Bread Day, and National One Cent Day. All of that happening on April 1st, Sunday, April 2nd, Geologist Day, World Autism Awareness Day, National Education and Sharing Day, National Ferret Day, National PB&J Day, Peanut Butter and Jelly Sandwich right. Day, Sunday, and National Reconciliation Day. All of those things happening this weekend. And I've got a guest. No, I don't. I've got two guests. <laughs> I have Carla Simone Spence and Sarah Collins both joining me for uh, a thing called and we're going to talk about a new uh, show they did called The Confessions of Franny Langton. So The Confessions of Franny Langton. We're going to be chatting with the two. One is the writer, creator, and the other is uh, one of the actresses in. And we'll be chatting with both of them from England here in just a bit. What a year. With prices on everything going up, it's more important than ever to have a better credit card. Some people use a credit card that's not a very good one. At BetterCreditCards.com, we offer a variety of credit card options to fit your needs. Whether you want a card to give you cash back or points and perks or a credit card to help you build your credit, we probably have it at BetterCreditCards.com. Give yourself a little credit. BetterCreditCards.com. That's BetterCreditCards.com. Now, surveys and studies and such brought to you by BetterCreditCards.com. Which app do most people want to delete from their phones? Instagram. Yeah, in a world where everybody's talking about getting rid of TikTok, Instagram came in number one as the thing people want gone. Security website VPNO, uh, they analyzed the internet search trends for the most 30 most popular apps to see which ones people were searching most in getting rid of. So like they were searching, how do you get rid of this? How do you dump this? 900,000 searches in the U.S. over the last six months alone. And how do I delete or deactivate Instagram? That is the most of any app, by the way. Huh. Facebook was a distant second with almost 400,000 searches. Snapchat, 217,000 searches. Twitter, 92,500 searches. And in spite of recent controversies, TikTok only had 14,120 searches. But how on old how is to that study? I oh, just, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. It says, uh, I don't know. It doesn't say when it was, but in the last six months. So. Right. All right. That surveys might have and increased since You think then. that has gone up? Surveys and studies and such brought to you by BetterCreditCards.com. Did you know you can allocate a percentage of your IRA to physical gold and silver with a tax-free rollover? You can put your IRA back on the gold standard. Genesis Gold IRA is the only IRA that can hold physical precious metals. Call now for your free gold and silver report and learn how to qualify for up to $10,000 in free silver. GenesisGoldIRA.com would like to help protect your IRA today with a simple phone call. Learn more and get the phone number at genesisgoldira.com. That's genesisgoldira.com. Did you know? Brought to you by genesisgoldira.com. Heidi, did you know spring fever is a real thing? It's an actual condition that happens this time of year. It's a real condition which commonly occurs when a sudden warm spell follows a long period of cold. When temperatures rise, the body needs to get rid of heat. Thus, there's a dilation of the blood vessels so that blood can be carried to the body surface where heat can be quickly lost. Some people experience an energetic feeling when this change happens due to the body's reaction to the great amount of internal work that's going on. I definitely do. So, I get spring fever every year. Yeah, I love it so right. much. We don't know everything, but now we know this. Brought to you by GenesisGoldIRA.com. Now, big screen, little screen, brought to you by ChannelSurferTV.com. History of the World Part 2 has become Hulu's most watched scripted original 2023 uh, in its first launch. The TV sequel to Mel Brooks' 1981 film earned the most social media engagements of any Hulu original as well on their premiere day. So apparently that has done quite well. That's awesome. We haven't been on Hulu in a while. I love Mel Brooks. I have Brooks. to go check that out one of these days. Um, Aaron Sorkin has revealed that he suffered a life-changing stroke back in November. West Wing creator told the New York Times that he realized he was grappling with major health issues and he started bumping into walls and corners and things. So that's kind of crazy. 
And Wendy McClendon Covey, who plays Beverly Goldberg on the ABC sitcom The Goldbergs, uh, was recently on a program talking about Jeff Garland and him moving on from the show and kind of what was going on there. The series finale airs May 3rd on ABC. And Jeremy Renner just marked a major milestone in his recovery, posted on Instagram Good. about his snowplow accident where he ran into the snowplow. Yeah. Boy, I'm, I'm really glad that he's okay. That could have gone... The other He's way, always seemed like easily. a really neat guy, too, hasn't yeah. he? I mean, it just yep. seems fun. I think so. Big Screen, Little Screen, brought to you by ChannelSurferTV.com. How much do you pay for your cell phone every month? If it's more than 15 bucks, it's time for a Mintervention. Mint Mobile makes it affordable and easy to switch. Get a new phone or bring in your current phone. iPhones and Samsung phones both work well with Mint Mobile. At Mintervention.com, you can see the current special offers from Mint Mobile, offering premium wireless for just $15 a month. That's far less than most people are paying, just $15 a month. Learn more now at Mintervention.com. That's Mintervention.com. Now your scoop of the day comes your way, courtesy of BetterCreditCards.com. This is a weird story. Human skull was found near Daytona Beach, Florida a little over a week ago. Yeah, that's kind of crazy. Uh, Recent surveys suggest that nearly 75% of people text or email or surf the web while on the toilet. What are you pointing at me for? (laughs) You're the one that bought me a smartphone. Uh I used to read all by myself in there. And now now I'm like, hey, look what I found. I'm sharing with Heidi. She's like, would you just hurry up and get out of there? I know. It takes forever. I'm usually waiting for us to go someplace. And I'm like, are you about done? Not my fault. You were the one that bought me a smartphone. (laughs) And scientists have found a more efficient way to suck up CO2, CO2 from the air. CO2 is carbon dioxide, I believe. Yes, it is. By storing it in baking soda and water. They say that method of sucking up atmospheric air and filtering out the CO2 can be improved by adding copper to the filter material, potentially opening up the technology to dozens more uses that could produce a meaningful difference in the fight against climate change, according to the story. The addition of copper also converts the captured CO2 to a harmless baking soda that could be stored in oceans or turned into a saleable product. Some scientists say the only way to limit global warming is uh, if we were to extract some of the CO2 that we've added to the atmosphere uh, through carbon capture methods. So, okay. So there are some folks that are gung-ho about this. There's other folks going, just be careful because you don't know what kind of side effects this is going to have. I just remember back in the 70s, I know. they wanted to fill the oceans with iodine to slow down global cooling. Yeah, and then it was global warming. Yeah, now if we had done that. Climate change. Yeah, no, it just, good Lord. Well, and my thing is, I don't know enough to even talk about this intelligently because I don't, and you don't. Neither of us have really studied any of this. No, but you just got to be careful. You can't be just jumping in and and doing stuff that's going to alter the planet. I think that we all need to take a little uh, step back and look at it and go, okay, what's going on and what what do we really And have we been wrong in the past? The answer is yes, Yes, every time. Over and over and over. So be careful out there. Scoop of the day comes your way, courtesy of BetterCreditCards.com. InsuranceChicken.com wants to know, how much are you paying for your insurance? I know it seems like a hassle to switch to a different company, but if you can save a few bucks, 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 it's worth crossing the road to InsuranceChicken.com. We have several of the top insurance companies trying to earn your business. They do that by offering great insurance that is cheap, cheap, cheap. Okay, enough of the silly chicken puns. It's time to get serious about saving you money on your insurance at Insurance insurancechicken.com. That's insurancechicken.com. Thank you for listening to the John and Heidi show. Excited to visit with not one, but two amazing guests today. Uh, First of all, we've got a novel that came out not too long ago, and that novel did really well. And then that novel has been turned into a program called The Confessions of Franny Langton, and it's been a huge hit in the United Kingdom. And now it's available in North America thanks to a partnership with BritBox, and that's uh, connected with the BBC. And we have on the program today the star of the program, Carla Simone Spence, and the writer and creator of the program, Sarah Collins. We're going to start with Carla Simone Spence. Let's talk a little bit about your role in this project. Yes, I play um, Franny Francis Langton, um, who's the lead of the show. And yeah, the story follows her journey from being accused of double murder. That's how the show starts out. Um, And she's a young Jamaican woman who's accused of double murder of the woman that she loves. And um, it follows her journey of trying to piece together what happened that night because she can't remember However, she refuses to believe that she is capable of killing the woman that she loves. And um, it follows her 
beautiful love story with Madame, um, the Madame at the house that she works as a maiden. And yeah, Fanny is an incredible character that I got to sink my teeth into. And I'm just so happy that Sara created her. I mean, how often do you see a Jamaican woman in a period drama? Um, yeah, I was just in awe that this was being created. I just had to be a part of it. And speaking of amazing characters, they all come to life because of the amazing writer-creator, Sara Collins. Sara, what is it like to see this project that you put your heart and soul into become such a huge hit? Oh, yeah. I mean, it feels completely surreal and joyful. And I, I am just incredibly proud that we were able to open the doors for ourselves to do something that I think is still sadly quite revolutionary in this day and age, which is to put a black Jamaican woman center stage in a period drama with a difference, you know, something I never saw growing up and I desperately wanted to see. So I just think it's a, it's a huge privilege to have been able to write the novel, to have been able to adapt it myself. And now to be able to witness Carla's absolutely breathtaking performance as Franny. Um, I, you know, I keep pinching myself. And this program has already been a huge hit in the United Kingdom, but now because of your partnership with BritBox, people in North America will be able to watch it as well. I'm just really excited that everyone gets to see the, the show that we put our blood so and tears into. Um, yeah, it's really exciting that now um, a wide audience gets to watch it. Um, yeah, I'm just really happy. Sarah, how does that partnership work? Do they come to you? Do you go to them? How does that work with BritBox? Oh, I mean, this was all done by the producers, Drama Republic, through their distributors. But I have to say that, and I know I'm going to speak for Carla Simone in saying this as well, that we have really loved working with BritBox. I mean, they are just incredibly exceptional hosts. Yeah. Um, to, to their creators. You know, they've looked after us so well. They hosted us for the film Bastards a couple of weeks ago, and we had an amazing time on the red mm-hmm. carpet with their team. So couldn't, couldn't be more delighted that they're our home in North America. Carla Simone, do you have additional projects that you're working on right now that you can talk about? Or I know how some of that is like top secret and we can't say anything too early. <laughs> Nothing I can say, but um, I definitely would love to work with Sarah again. I love her so much. And likewise. Yeah. And Sara, do you have some projects you're working on, either creating new stories or maybe continuing on with the story we have here? Oh, I'm done with this story. Done, done, done. <laughs> I've been working on this story since 2016. <laughs> do you- um, yeah, I'm moving on to other things. And I, I echo what Carla Simone said. I am just really excited to find something that we can sink our teeth in together um, again in the near future. Well, and it looks like when the two of you team up, you do really, really well. So we'll all be anticipating that. Yes, watch this space. Watch this space. (laughs) Well, thank you so much for your time today. And I'm going to throw a link so folks can find this program. It looks really good. Uh, Carla Simone, thank you for your time. Thank you. And Sara, thank you so much for your time today as well. Oh, thank you for having us. It's been a real pleasure. Again, the program is called The Confessions of Franny Langton. You can find that now in North America, thanks to our friends at BritBox. I'm going to throw a link so you can find the trailer and you can find all of the information and uh, find out how to become a subscriber on BritBox if you'd like to check out this program and many other amazing things. All of the details can be found in the show notes for today at johnandheidyshow.com. What a year. With prices on everything going up, it's more important than ever to have a better credit card. Some people use a credit card that's not a very good one. At BetterCreditCards.com, we offer a variety of credit card options to fit your needs. Whether you want a card to give you cash back or points and perks or a credit card to help you build your credit, we probably have it at BetterCreditCards.com. Give yourself a little credit. BetterCreditCards.com. That's BetterCreditCards.com. Fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? The difference between jelly and jam is jelly is made with fruit juice. Jam is made with mashed fruit. Ah. Did you know that difference? <laughs> I've never N- been no, concerned about it. Fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? In, a, uh, in feudal Japan, lords purposely built homes with squeaky floors as a defense measure against ninjas. That's smart. Oh, yeah. That's a good idea. Hey, fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? There's no female peacocks anywhere in the world. What? No. Peacocks are males. Females are peahens. Oh. Uh, the collective name for both is pea fowl. Ah, now we know. Uh, another fun fact for you, Heidi. That makes sense that the male is yeah, the peacock. Yeah, well, of course. And then the female would be the peahen. That's exactly why they call them that. <laughs> yeah. All right. Fun fact for you, Heidi. <laughs>
According to experts, camels have the worst breath in the animal kingdom. <laughs> Sorry, camels. Aww. And our final fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? The males of many species act like infants to woo potential mates. Apparently, that works in, in humans as well. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Several fun facts. Now you know. Thanks for listening to The John and Heidi Show. Did you know you can allocate a percentage of your IRA to physical gold and silver with a tax-free rollover? You can put your IRA back on the gold standard. Genesis Gold IRA is the only IRA that can hold physical precious metals. Call now for your free gold and silver report and learn how to qualify for up to $10,000 in free silver. GenesisGoldIRA.com would like to help protect your IRA today with a simple phone call. Learn more and get the phone number at GenesisGoldIRA.com. That's GenesisGoldIRA.com. Time now for the Mint Mobile Question of the Day. Yay! It's brought to you by Mintervention.com. Question for you, Heidi. 66% of us fall asleep with one of these in our bed. What is it? 66%. A dog. No. A remote control. I was oh. so nervous when I was handing that to you. I thought for, this is going to go the wrong way and you were going to say something dumb. Uh, but dog was a good answer. Remote control is the correct answer. Mint Mobile question of the day comes your way, courtesy of Mintervention.com. How much do you pay for your cell phone every month? If it's more than 15 bucks, it's time for a Mintervention. Mint Mobile makes it affordable and easy to switch. Get a new phone or bring in your current phone. iPhones and Samsung phones both work well with Mint Mobile. At Mintervention.com, you can see the current special offers from Mint Mobile, offering premium wireless for just $15 a month. That's far less than most people are paying, just $15 a month. Learn more now at Mintervention.com. That's Mintervention.com. Now, some weird news brought to you by WeirdGiftOfTheDay.com. What is being called the last ever gas-powered muscle car from Dodge is definitely going to go out with a bang or more likely with some squeals and some screeches and probably some speeding tickets. 2023 Challenger SRT Demon 170 will deliver 1,025 horsepower from its 6.2-liter supercharged V8. Oh, oh, oh. The automaker says it will be the quickest production car made. Automaker uh, Stellantis, I think is how you say it, formed in 2021 by combining Fiat Chrysler and France's PSA Pugo. They say it can go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in an arm hair raising 1.66 seconds. So you said this is the very last gas powered, so they're not going to make... Well, Apparently not. Making it wow. faster than even the electric supercars from Tesla. Uh, they're going to stop making gas versions of Dodge, Challenger, and Charger, and the big Chrysler 300 stand by the end of this year due to new fuel economy regulations, and they're going to shift everything over to electric vehicles. Wow. So, there we go. Weird news brought to you by weirdgiftoftheday.com. Time now for the list brought to you by BetterCreditCards.com. These are facts that people used to believe that are not necessarily facts. This is from Reddit. My grandmother told me when I was little that if I didn't have enough money at the checkout, they would just throw me in jail. I was scared of that until I became a teen. Wow. Oh. <laughs> I thought toilets really did spin the other day when you crossed the equator. Wait, they don't? The other way. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently they don't. Okay. Uh, my college roommate's girlfriend asked, how do they know where to put gas stations he explained that companies probably do market research to determine if they need another gas station in the area. She responded, no, I mean, how do they know where there will be more gas on the corner when they build the station there? Oh, my god! Oh, wow. Uh, another thing people believe, uh, they say bats are not blind. They have eyes and can see. They've also got excellent night vision. All right. Oh. And uh, different sections of our tongue detect different tastes. That's something that people I did believe. Know. Oh, I thought that. I did think Facts that. Facts that people used to believe. Apparently, these things are wrong. I've got the entire list in the show notes for today at johnandheidyshow.com. And now I'm just confused. Insurancechicken.com wants to know, how much are you paying for your insurance? I know it seems like a hassle to switch to a different company, but if you can save a few bucks, 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 it's worth crossing the road to insurancechicken.com. We have several of the top insurance companies trying to earn your business. They do that by offering great insurance that is cheap, cheap, cheap. Okay, enough of the silly chicken puns. It's time to get serious about saving you money on your insurance at insurancechicken.com. That's insurance chicken.com quote of the day comes your way courtesy of insurancechicken.com quote today is from h kyle seal or maybe seely s-e-a-l-e how would you say that seal sure or seely um quote is i thought i was wrong once 
but I was mistaken. (laughs) 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 I like it. That is your quote of the day. It comes your way, courtesy of insurancechicken.com. Thanks for listening to the John and Heidi Show this weekend. John and Heidi. This portion of the John and Heidi Show is brought to you by the John and Heidi Show. That sounds kind of funny, but it's true. Go to your local radio station and ask them to start carrying the John and Heidi Show. Here's the best part. They can carry the show for free. They play a couple commercials, but it doesn't cost them anything every month. So if you know a radio station that could use a little bit of help, send them our way. Send them to johnandheidyshow.com. Again, johnandheidyshow.com. We would love to do a radio program in your community. Then you could listen to the podcast and listen to us on the radio. John and Heidi. We always like to wrap things up around here with good news, and I think this is good news. It comes your way courtesy of GenesisGoldIRA.com. Here's the headline for you, Heidi. Teen heroes rush into rough surf and save two 11-year-old girls from drowning. Oh, wow. Isn't this amazing? This happened in Australia. Two heroes have been awarded bravery medals by the Governor General of Australia, January 20th in 2021, Bella Broadley and Elise Patridge were enjoying a picnic on the beach when a woman approached their group and asked for help. They were having a picnic with some girlfriends and a woman came up and said, hey, I can't swim. My girls are drowning. And we just jumped in. They're now 20 years old. The younger girls were caught in a riptide, overwhelmed by the waves. To make things worse, it was around 8 p.m. and it was starting to get dark. Oh, my gosh. She said it was so rough. It was crazy. I uh, was swimming out thinking, oh my gosh, how am I going to get back in? Right, exactly. This is bad. But luckily, I have the esky lid for parts on my way. What? Of the esky lid for parts on the way to keep my head above water. I don't know what that means. Hmm. Once I got to Violet, I just swam for my life. So they must have had like a, a cooler lid. Is that what that is? Oh, maybe. Yeah, they handed a cooler lid off maybe. to Chloe. Yeah, that's what it is. Uh, it's a cooler lid. And uh, anyway, these these two girls, they did this. The thing that's amazing to me, this happened January 20th, not 2023, not even 2022, 2021. Why are we just now getting this story? Well, and why are they, they just now getting this award right, for bravery? I was going to say, they must have just now gotten the award. Yeah, it just seems very weird. Anyway, Wednesday, they were named uh, these, uh, they were named with this award. They were honored with this award. 66 different people were honored, by the way, at, on that same day. So... So apparently they just wait until, hey, let's wait till we have we a whole lot bunch. of heroes. Let's have a ceremony. Get a whole stack of heroes here. Let's do it. <laughs> They're piling Make, up. You got all these heroes <laughs> wading through heroes. I'm not sure how they come up with the plan to do it when they do it, but I still think it's a really cool story. Thanks for listening to the John and Heidi Show this weekend. Time to say goodbye, Heidi. Goodbye, Heidi. Goodbye, everybody. Have a great day. Thank you for listening to the John and Heidi Show.